as we move on to their set against blah blah blah. Yeah, and the big thing is what we've seen as well with uh, Lucy's counter pick earlier is that Kater is uh, seems to be much more comfortable against characters who are heavier, who are more combo food material, like Atlas, obviously. Yeah, and we go to Ethereal Gates for game one. And Bleb already taking the first hit. They are just dancing around with each other. Two of the best movement characters in this game, in my opinion. Absolutely, and Bleb already going very deep to try and get a very early kit. Oh, rolling out with the fairs with the RBs. They have and very it. brave uh, little interaction there from Kata. That down video is going to take that. Yeah. I feel honestly like uh, Kata's biggest weak spot in those games has been uh, the, the recovery. He's getting edge guarded very easily overall. Like, still manages to, you know, stall. Oh, but uh, he, he gets caught a lot. Yeah, and as we've seen, Ethelus can just be a wall for anyone trying to recover. Especially a character like Zadabad, who is so linear in their recovery. And that actual Kader taking uh, getting down to their last stock as Lev just holds on to their first. Yeah, Lev setting up armor, going to use the F-Strong for that light armor through to try and catch Kater uh, off guard. 171% on live, everything is going to kill at this point. But uh, still, uh, we still have a situation. Yeah, the, the parry. The, the side B was a little bit obvious here and it's going to be well parried here by Kater. Uh oh. The yeah. backhead nearly yeah. killing from the front. Yeah. Which I don't know how to feel about. Uh, it's back here, it's Ella's back here. We stop questioning it at this point. Right. Why does it do a knife sound? Why does it uh, stand to the front? <laughs> I mean... Hey, it does a knife sound because this is, is sharp. It, it, he makes sharp knives with his feet, but whatever. <laughs> Regardless, Leblemek takes game one over Kato. And yeah, very solid showing overall from Bleb. Just, uh... You know, doing bleb things on Cater, and we are going to go to Odin stage, which is just... <laughs> no, hide away. Just, yeah. honestly, I'd like to say it is a UK favorite, Cater uh, <laughs> hailing from the UK. Yeah. But to be fair, I can, I can see it in this matchup just a little bit. Just because Cater uh, was losing some very early stocks and maybe he just wants the, the space to breathe at this point. Oh, takes the first stock over Blablamic here. Now can they keep this pressure up or is Bleb going to pull out with a quick stock here? I mean, you, you can just random right there or try to random baby. hammer in the air! Bleb, what the heck, man? I mean, oh... Yeah, Kater just got scared, honestly. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> the mid-air hammer was too much. I mean, yeah, that, that, uh... <laughs> that was... <laughs> oh, uh... Kater in chat saying they accidentally tabbed out there. That was the cause of that first start. But... That aside, not letting it slow him down. Yeah. Lev, however, still keeping Kater at bay here on that right side. Kater's gonna be able to get back on stage. But uh, yeah, so far it's looking like a very Kater favored game overall. They can't count Lev out just yet. We have seen how well this SLS can yeah. do. Especially this, has a, this season. A, yeah, a single pip of ice to get armor back. Going to allow him to live just a little, that tad bit longer, potentially against Cater. We are going to get paired here, and yeah, fireball dash attack up strong, completely locking out Lev here, and Cater is going to take a game here. Move on, tier game three.
Oh, I do wonder where Bleb is going to be taking us to a place hideout. To, to hideout. I'm always very torn about this stage for uh, Atlas's. But at the same time, I can I can always see how to exploit that uh, that top platform once you have the, the ice set up. Yeah, and of course, Atlas does have F-Tilt for the grounded ice, so... It... Ooh! Yeah, going G for the up here! Just telling Kader to get back down there. Yeah. I also think it's a rather high blast zone, honestly, in terms of that bottom blast zone. It's pretty good for Bleb if he wants to go deeper. Photo spikes. Ooh, cancels the down fear. That was a intimidation tactic there. <laughs> Kader uh, t showing in chat a bit of uh, regret on not banning this game. So, I'm, I can clearly see why this uh, I can see why. is favored. It's a yeah. very good stage for Bleb. Yeah, Bleb very comfortable right now on the on this stage. Just barely avoiding a, a parry with the, those icicles. And uh, yeah, Bleb just uh, not letting the, uh, not, let, uh, not letting up the pressure. That's the other thing as well. Having this top platform that you can go through from top to bottom is also oh. pretty good for confirms. Okay. Interesting angle here. Oh dear, does not take the down air. Bleb takes game three. I'm just dominating game three. <laughs> yeah, very much showing why Arcada was correct to regret that stage pick. Yeah, the, the, that's why we're going to Frozen Fortress for game four. Yeah, they pretty dang good Zetaburn stage. Those platforms that the double the dunk. double dunk disgusting play. From Arcade there. Oh, that was beautiful. Yeah. It's always nice to see uh, the double dunk. Uh oh. It's very efficient, but Bleb just doing Bleb things once again! Taking the taking this all the way to the yeah. bank and to the blast zone. Yeah, both players showing the best you can do with a character in a single interaction. Oh, that was nearly dangerous, but Kato was already on stage when getting hit by the up hand, so he was safe from the dump. Yeah, and Bleb again with the oh. fares, going to take Kato off stage and off the stage. Kato's and now we have a lost stock situation for Kato, who really needs to, you know, do something about, you know, not dying to fair. Yeah, this is looking very bad for Kato. This is the highest I've seen him in bracket in a while, so it'd be a shame to see him go so yeah, soon. Well, the up bear just <laughs> barely with the weird angles and the weird bounces from uh -oh. the stage. Back in pressure. This is not looking good for Kader. Yeah, and the parry and will be a kill it. for Bleb. And Bleb is going to move on to loser semis, where we're going to have our uh, endless mirror. Yeah, that was amazing to see from Arcada and I must <laughs> correct myself Arcada did get quite high up uh, last time I believe I was either just not paying attention or I just wasn't 